वेलकम फ्रेंड्स मैं डॉक्टर जीतू मिश्रा आज मैं आपको हिजामा थेरेपी के बारे में बेनिफिट्स बताऊंगा इस वीडियो को पूरा एंड तक सुनते रहिए और देखते रहिए कि हिजामा थेरेपी कितना यूजफुल होता है तो मैं ये बताना चाहूँगा देर इज़ अ लॉट ऑफ एंथम फॉर कपिंग थेरेपी दीज डेज विथ मैनी वेस्टर्न सेलिब्रिटीज एंड ओलम्पिक एथलीट्स मेकिंग फॉर द कपिंग थेरेपी कपिंग इज़ अ कॉमनली यूज टू ट्रीट पेन इट रिलैक्स द वून टिश्यूज एंड एसोसिएटेड टिश्यूज within the muscle and reduces the swelling and knots of the muscle if you have not heard of cupping then let us tell you that it is a very simple therapy in which these small cups are kept attached to the skin by creating a vacuum under the cup this cup pulls the skin up towards itself cupping therapy is an ancient traditional and adjuvant medical practice recently there has been growing evidence of its potential benefits in the treatment of pain related elements Cupping therapy also known, known as hizama therapy in some arabic culture is a fascinating alternative form of medicine that is also possibly mentioned in historical sources dating back 5000 years back cupping therapy or hizama is an ancient form of alternative medicine in which a practitioner places special cups on your skin for a few minutes to create a stretch or suction this stretch facilitates healing of blood flow Hizama is used by people for many purposes such as helping with pain, swelling, blood flow, relaxation and deep tissue massage. Some modern cupping therapy specialists have begun to use rubber pumps instead of traditional cup heating methods. When a hot cup is placed over your skin, the air inside the cup cools and creates a vacuum that pulls up the skin and muscles in the cup. Your skin may turn red as the blood vessel responds to changes in the pressure on them. in dry cupping therapy the cup is set for uh, of time usually between 10 to 15 minutes in wet cupping therapy the doctor removes the cups and make a special incision to drain the minor blood with the cup usually only in a place for a few minutes you may have 5 to 7 8 10 cups on your first session therapist may ask and this is where a lot of people keep asking how many cups will be placed so this is a, a practitioner's distinction and his interpretation that how many cups he likes to put on his first session of a patient after the cups are placed and cuts are made the cups are placed for 10 15 minutes and once the clot is uh, formed the cups are removed the doctor may cover the previously cupped areas with ointment bandages it helps to prevent infection any bruises or other scar usually go away within 10 days of session Cupping therapy is sometimes combined with acupuncture treatment in which the practitioner first picks acupuncture needles into the points and then cups. For best result you can eat only light meal 2 to 3 hours before your cupping. Although many international athletes say that they have experienced benefit from the therapy, there are few solid scientific studies on the subject and it is not clear whether the benefits of treatment are placebo or that hizama actually has any psychological benefits cupping therapy or hizama increases the blood circulation to the area where the cups are placed this can relieve tension to the muscle which improves overall blood flow and promotes the speed of cell repair it can also help new surrounding fused tissue and form new blood vessels and what is the most important aspect is the disadvantages of hizama cupping therapy Hizama procedure is generally safe when performed by trained professionals but there can be some disadvantages of hizama at the place where the cups touch your skin which are as mild discomfort or pain redness marks burns occasional skin infection so for if you find these things on your first session please consult your doctor and treat the redness treat the uh, skin burns or anything and keep uh, asking the question that you like to ask if you have any queries you can comment in this section and video ko like kare share kare subscribe kare thank you